Hey, Matthew Hagee here. Uh, congratulations, graduating class of 2020. I asked on Facebook uh, to put together other people's words of wisdom of what they would tell the graduating class of 2020. So here it is. Um, Rebecca Whitley says, enjoy life, travel and explore before you settle down to a career in marriage. I love that advice. Um, go get some you time. Stella Fasanello says, from experience, stay in contact with Heggy. Yay! Even if it's through social media, you will need a healthy influence in this uh, life. Uh, then she says to me, thanks for being a positive presence uh, for so many years over the past 21 years and counting. So, you know, hey, maybe uh, following me on social media could help you or just inspire you. Not my words, her words. Anyway, um, Renee D'Amica says, don't take yourself too seriously. As soon as you can laugh at yourself, the world becomes a much more fun, goofy, awesome place. I love it, be able to laugh at yourself and take things in levity. Um, Kim Fritz says, hard work will beat talent um, when talent doesn't work hard. I love waking up and grinding and putting in that hard work and that hard effort. Um, protect your health. Always be learning, growing, and improving. Find your passion and follow it. And your passion can change. Mine's been phys ed. Uh, fitness and health for the past 20 years, but you could have more than one passion. Uh, my friend Tom Savantri says, the responsibility for the direction, success, and happiness in your life is your own. No one deserves or owes you anything. Um, Jen Reed says, breathe. We did that every day in phys ed class through our meditation. Be open and say yes to every opportunity that comes your way. Well, you might want to analyze it first, but... Remember to breathe. Uh, Nanette Needle says, don't be afraid to take education, educated risks and try new things. Um, don't be afraid to fail. Actually, failure is your first step in growth and learning. Don't seek it out, but be okay with it. Follow your heart and do what you want, not what others want or expect out of you. Do what you want. Um, Greg Krantz says, take risks while young. Push your limits. Pursue your dreams. Save. Uh, do what you love to earn money and you'll never work a day in your life. Don't waste uh, their youth when they are young, okay? Save, love, be real. Uh, Barb Miller says, dream big, work hard. I love the idea of dreaming big. I'm 43 years old, I think I am, and I'm still dreaming big every day. So dream big. Um, Robin Brand says, wash your hands, okay? Dan Wygant says, live life, be happy, have a positive influence in somebody else's life. Um, take care of yourself first so that you can put others first. Man, that's fantastic. Uh, my football coach from college, Rich Alercio, says their path to their finish line was blocked. Okay, there's big lessons in here. Um, they had to find a new path. There will always be another path when obstacles stand in your way. These are just so great. Um, my chiropractor and good friend, Trish Colasardo, says we choose between two types of pain. The pain of discipline and commitment and the pain of regret and disappointment. Okay, you get to pick your pain. Okay, so do you want discipline and commitment or do you want regret and disappointment? Either way, there's gonna be pain. Um, be kind and learn from others. Uh, Lynn Gale, that's a great one. Um, Greg Bellotti, uh, we played football in college together, TCNJ. Legacies and greatness are created in the face of adversity. So adversity is a good thing. Uh, challenge and what may seem unfair. Okay, all those things are positive in life challenges and what's unfair. It is of those times you need to perform and deliver. The situation will not be the last time you are disappointed or something did not go according to your plan. Take these opportunities to be special and rise above the circumstances. So the obstacle is the way. A lot of people go, oh, there's an obstacle. The obstacle is the way. That's why it's there because it's trying to make you better. Uh, my buddy Rod Luckenbill says, here's one word, resilience. Build from there. Okay, great, great advice by Wendy Tinner. Um, avoid debt, learn financial responsibility, follow Dave Ramsey, live honestly, and play the long game. Um, Elena Fennell, Del Val graduate, I believe she's a doctor now. Work hard, be kind, and fight for truth and justice in the world. Wow, that couldn't be any more important today uh, than it's ever been. Uh, Amanda Kovacs, the sooner you don't care what people think of you, the happier you'll be. Wow. Be you. There's going to be people in your life who love you. There's going to be people in your life who hate you. Listen to those who love you because now you can be you more often around those who love you. I love it. Um, Amanda Perkins says, these are all great. One thing I would add is no matter where life brings you, you are never too young or too old to learn and grow. 
You're never too young. You're never too old. I'm 43. I love still growing and changing. So keep that up. Um, Gail uh, DePayne says, live for the day, but also plan for the future. I mean, that's so true. Let's be here in the present, but don't be afraid to look into the future. That's such a hard balance to find. Nick Volkoff says, college isn't for everyone. Don't be afraid to choose another path. That's true. And high school wasn't for everybody also. So it's okay to choose another, another path. Um, Linda Ray says, give yourself the space to attend to your own mental health. Okay. Diet, exercise, meditation. Okay. Proper amounts of sleep. So uh, to pay attention to your own mental health. Great advice. My friend Jeff Lazarus says, life is about creating memories. I love creating memories with my wife, with my family, with my friends. Um, you know, even as a teacher, you guys have created memories with me and I appreciate that and I appreciate you and I want to say thank you for that. Um, Larissa Marie says, be kind, always be kind, be the light to somebody else's darkness and their hope in a storm. Changing the world starts with the little things. I, I was uh, uh, looking out the street the other day and there's a piece of plastic going around and a guy stopped his bike and he threw it in the garbage. That was the little thing, but it's huge. Um, Golnaz, uh, Golnaz uh, Sumru says, do the right thing. Cecilia Baxter says, people may forget what you say or even what you do, but they will never forget how you make them feel. Be kind and offer, <clears throat> offer compassion. Jeremy Salheimer, my receiver in high school uh, for, for football, we're on the same team. He says, be ready when adversity hits. Uh, Patty Julianne says, don't let the fear of striking out keep you from playing the game. Oh, these are great. These are great. Deb Amron, um, you know, great, great family. Del Val People says, work hard, play hard. No doubt. No doubt. Um, Sarah uh, Dalen says, remember to always treat the janitor of your company with the same respect as the CEO. You know, treat everybody the same. We're all human beings. Um, listen to your gut. My dad, Joe Heggie, says, avoid debt. Well, I've, we, we've done that, so that's a good one. Um, Kelly Brennan says, seek and listen to the advice of others, but don't follow it blindly. Do what works for you. Find new ways to live and celebrate. Always celebrate, always celebrate. Julia, question mark, one of the best runners ever at Del Val, uh, one of my cross-country runners, says, always continue to learn Think critically and ask questions. Be empathetic and be open to changing your mind. I love sharing that because I just have such respect for Julia and who she is and how she lives her life. Um, Steven Sylvester, a, uh, one of the uh, uh, people who works at Del Val, he says, fishing, hiking, surfing, hunting, and anything else outdoors is always a plus. Of course it is. <clears throat> Shari Matarazzo says, stop, breathe, enjoy the moment. You'll be back and remember it differently than while you're living it. So enjoy the moment. I love it. My friend Danielle Fornicola says, have you ever listened to commitment speech? Okay, she'll tag me in it. Well, um, Arnold Miller, you can never get time back. Make every second count. Cherish moments you have to spend with your friends, family. Try new things and enjoy life. And with that being said, you and I as seniors spent time together. And I really appreciate that. I cannot get that time back. And I enjoyed sharing my life with you. So thank you. Um, Kathy Erico says, every one of these quotes is great. She's got nothing more. Kendra Nestor, former Del Val uh, employee says, those moments when you feel alone, you're not. When you feel alone, you're not. The moment when the world seems too big, it is. Explore it. Um, moments when you are scared, anxious, stop. Breathe, move, move forward. Again, we're going with that breathing theory. Those times you want to speak, listen. Oh my gosh, such a huge skill. Open your mind to new ideas. So hard to do. Keep your heart open to peace and never forget from where you came. Never forget from where you came. I mean, open to peace. I mean, once again, it resonates in our world today. Alyssa Robertson says, try to harness your attributes for good. Tell them the boy's story without naming names. Uh, what he did with his, okay. So that's another one. Um, if you won't remember in five years why something is getting you down, then don't let it get you down. I took a test in college and I got a, a C on it. I think I'm like, this isn't gonna make a difference 10 years down the road. And it didn't, I still am where I am. Uh, don't get all C's, but when you get the occasional bad grade, it's okay. 
Eleanor Herman, one of my relatives and a uh, famous published author, says, um, know that there are always more than two choices to make at a given time. There is not uh, always a yes. Uh, there is not, not yes and now. There is maybe and later and let's wait and a million other paths to follow. In school, we train you poorly sometimes. There's either A is the right answer, everything else is wrong. But in life, there's more than one right answer. So I think that's great advice. I love teaching that. Kathy Ricchetti says, be kind to yourself, former Del Val uh, employee. Uh, life is hard and we are only human. Congratulations to the class of 2020. She's sending you love and hearts. Um, uh, Donna Maxwell says, okay, check out her video. Um, and then a parent just says, thank you. You know, I like that. Say thank you to people. Uh, oh, Matt Panfile says, there's no shame on being a welder, an electrician, a plumber, or a mechanic. Once again, we've heard that advice. Jenna Katz Segal, she is a Tony Award winning producer on Broadway. She says, work doesn't have to be what you love, it has to pay your bills. Love who and what you do outside of work. And then if you happen to love what you do at work, then you really have it all. <clears throat> so again, Find out what you love, find out your passion, and find a way to make money doing it. Um, uh, hopefully I paraphrase that the right way, but do what you love. Kristen Higgins says, uh, uh, Hinkstman says, learn how to manage your money. Don't think you have to have certain things at a particular age. Your life may not be what you planned. I love that. But always make the best of your current situation. There's always someone who will support your and lend a hand. Uh, support you. It may not be a relative or a friend. It may be a stranger or a coworker. Don't be afraid to ask for help. My mother-in-law always says it's the most important word you can use are I need help. Kelly Schneider, I will tell them to travel. Take time to explore, to go to places that they've always dreamed of going. Find their independence. Be comfortable out out there on your own and figure out what it means to only rely on themselves. One of the most important things I'm trying to teach my children is self-reliance, okay? Figure out on your own. Um, but sometimes it's okay to ask for help. So a little bit of a dichotomy there. Cody Lay, former Del Val student, really, really intelligent kid, great person. Um, don't, go to, uh, don't go to college because everyone else is or because your parents want you to. Find a career that makes you excited to get up in the morning to go to work. Work for the job you want, not the job you are paid to do. Again, similar advice from Jenna. I just love these. These are great. Uh, Karen Melissa says, be you. Listen to those you respect. Do your own research. Make your own decisions. And again, we're going back to the concept of be kind. Always be kind. I love that. Shauna Oakland. Go be an astronaut so you could get off the planet for a while. <laughs> love it. Juliana Louisa, we grew up together. You can never discover new oceans unless you have the courage to lose sight of the shore. I love it. And again, always be kind. Do your best to be kind. And sometimes it's hard to, to, to do. Penny Cassiola um, says, adapt and persevere. I love the concept of perseverance and always adapt and grow and change. Love it. Um, Jim Kosalko says, beware of murder hornets. Okay, something to be aware of out there. <laughs> Uh, John Dowgan uh, quoted something from Mount Rushmore. Um, Scott Dyer says, remember, life is a roller coaster. It has ups, downs, twists, turns, and thrills that you can experience if you just take a chance. You know, we learned about that on the high elements. Take chances. Uh, Bill Dennis says, the AD is always right, even when he is wrong. <laughs> so uh, listen to Bill. Don Anthony says, the last piece of cheesecake at the dinner looks tempting, but you'll regret it when you get older. Hey, you know, I had, you could have your cheesecake every now and then. Alicia Roman, former Del Val student says, if you are continuing school, make sure you focus on school from the beginning. Never give up if it gets too hard and have as much fun as you can making memories that will last forever. Brian Huff, a friend of mine uh, says, yesterday is in the past and tomorrow is not promised. Live in the moment. Uh, one of my friends growing up from high school, Kelly Perkins Libro says, take, advantage, take yourself seriously. Believe that you can do big things. And if you don't believe it, fake it till you make it, baby. And always be happy. All right. Rich Fabian says, always say please and thank you. Congratulations to the class of 2020. I love you all. Thank you for being a part of my life. Peace.